Plus, we're also taking a look at how a fight last Friday night in Riviera Beach led to the Cluiston football team getting suspended. The fight involving players and fans. What we know about an investigation that's underway. I'm Fox 4's Dominga Murray here at Cluiston High School in Hendry County. A fight broke out on this football field on Friday night, and now athletes at this school are paying quite the price. I don't think they should be suspended. Third quarter at Inlet Grove with Cluiston in the lead brought on a fight Friday night. Take a look. We all just got to be civilized and just stop the violence. The game turned brawl between Cluiston and Inlet Grove has very real consequences. The Florida High School Athletic Association suspended Cluiston's team indefinitely. Now we're asking students what they think happened and how it should get resolved. The other, I mean, you know, the other team started throwing the first punch because they lost, and that's why they're getting mad. Students like Amish Roberts they really from do my team like that. share the sentiment that whomever threw the first punch should pay the biggest price. I feel like our school is supposed to have been free and the other school is supposed to get suspended and not us. This is part of a letter the Hendry County School District sent out to staff, students, and parents. It says in part, FHSAA has requested information from Cluiston High School to investigate the incident. The status of the last two regular session games remains unknown at this time. If they didn't start the fight, which I heard they didn't, then they shouldn't get suspended. I think the other team should take full consequences. I think it's bad that they're getting suspended, even though it's not their fault. It's unclear at this point if Inlet Grove's team will also get suspended. We're waiting on the FHSAA response. Make it fair, because they both fought. Like, yeah, that's what they do in school. There's two people fought, we both get suspended. So, like, suspend the whole team, both teams. In Hendry County, I just think they should get punished, but not a suspension. Domingo Murray, Fox 4.